are at Bye Bye Baby. This is gonna be a shop for my baby with me. Look at this one. It's so girly and so beautiful. The store is fun. We have a whole Disney collection. Look how adorable with like the eyelet ruffle. Carriers, there's so many different options. Hello everyone, what is up? And welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Katie. I live in Orlando. I make all shop with me and DIY home decorating videos. But today is a little bit different because we are at Bye Bye Baby. This is gonna be a shop for my baby with me. I am due really soon, like honestly any day now, and I have never been to Bye Bye Baby, and it is like the Mecca, the Target of baby stores, the Walmart, I don't know, I, they have everything, I guess. So I'm super excited to go inside. We have a couple things off of our registry that we still need, and then a lot of things that we've ordered we still haven't seen in person. So really excited to go in there and just kind of play around. This is gonna be a super fun video, definitely different than what I normally do. I will definitely show nursery furniture and take a look at any nursery decor that they have, but I don't know. A lot of you guys really want to see baby stuff and us shopping for the baby. And when I say us, it's because I have this guy here with me today. Hello, hello. Are you excited for Very. Bye Bye Baby? Very. All the things. I mean, we have tons of baby stuff at home already, obviously, but we're just really excited to go in there and, you know, see what we can still buy or what we might still need because you don't know what you don't need, especially as first time parents. So if you're excited, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below and the notification bell if you're excited for all my future shopping videos. I have lots of like Easter decorations decorating videos coming up, obviously with the baby being born, the nursery haul, and the nursery makeover. Lots of exciting things, so be sure to hit that subscribe button, and let's head into Bye Bye Baby. Okay, so trying to get a lay of the land. Those were the first few things I saw when I walked in, and I'm already like, this is so fun, I'm so overwhelmed, but trying to get a lay of the land. I think we're gonna look at all the nursery decor first, and then look at like strollers and stuff like that, so. Let's look for some decor. There's also a lot of really cute clothes. This store's so fun. Okay, first thing I see when I walk in, which I'm actually like really pumped about, are these like as-is deals. So these are like furniture pieces that they're selling as-is because they may have some sort of like defect. Like right here on this gray nightstand, I feel like you could just easily fix that with like some paint. They also have this really nice dresser and the changing topper. We definitely want one of these toppers, but we need not a white one. I don't want to tell you exactly what color we need because I'm trying to keep everything more of a surprise, but we don't need a white one or else I would totally buy this. But like the prices are really, really good. So over here in like the nursery decor section, they have everything broken down by like decor style, which I really like. So they call this like the rustic farmhouse design. And a lot of these pieces, like this is what we saw over in the like discounted section. This is really nice stuff. Like the quality feels really, really nice. Love the changing topper again. I think it's so nice to have a place where like you know that they're secure on here and then there's also a place where you can put like baskets and really organize everything you need for diapering. I think that that's really important because I just really want to stay organized. But this feels like really good quality. I do like how they have a set. We decided to go with separate pieces and kind of like do our own thing. But these sets are really easy if you have a hard time making decisions. Here's another set. This one's nice. I like the gray. I am not a big fan of like white furniture. That's just something that I have realized about myself. So I didn't do any white furniture in our nursery. Really, really love the gray. This is the double sided changing topper. Obsessed with this one. And this changing pad is really nice. Also like the cover. Love the colors. I wanna do like green in our nursery maybe. This crib is an absolute steal. I love the board and batten look on the back. And I know I said I don't like white furniture, but this is really, really pretty. I just love the simplicity of the shape and we really like cribs that are like open on all four sides so that's a really nice touch and this is only $200 this is literally a steal and then look how pretty this crib sheet is I've struggled to find really nice crib sheets so here it seems like they have a really big selection and I really like this one the colors are super pretty in our house we don't have tons and tons of color but in her room you may be surprised with what we end up going with look at this one it's so girly and so beautiful just like the bubbling at the top and then this really beautiful ornate bow pattern that's kind of like put onto the crib it also has these really beautiful spindles and then they have a lace like crib bed sheet or bed skirt crib skirt whatever they are called so this one's super super girly and they have a dresser that goes with it and look at this like blinged out hardware and then they also have like an armoire which is like really nice for all of their clothes and stuff because some clothes are hung and then other clothes are kind of like rolled and folded 
This one is so pretty and so girly. No wonder I love it so much. Look what it's called, the Aurora. If you didn't know, one of our dogs is named Aurora and she is my first baby. So of course it's called that. This crib is beautiful. It actually looks really similar to the one that we already got. This one's only $400. This is the Everly 3-in-1 Island crib. This is beautiful. Also like love these little baskets and hamper. We need a hamper. All of this stuff is so sweet. I know in cribs when they are little for safe sleeping, you're not supposed to have like blankets or anything. So these are mostly decorative items, but they have a lot of really pretty stuff right here. This one says, hello, lovely. This blanket is so, so soft. They also have a bunch of different mobiles or mobiles. We don't have one of these for our crib. I don't think that we're gonna get one, but they are really adorable. They just have so many fun little options right here. Look at this one, this mobile plays music. They have a whole Disney collection. We love to see it. Lots of like Minnie Mouse stuff and princess items. Like this pillow that has the crown. It says a dream is a wish your heart makes. It's all embroidered, that's really nice. These don't have removable covers, so keep that in mind. They also have like a changing pad cover that has a crown. It says little princess, that's really adorable. They have so many different like Disney items. So they have like Minnie Mouse, they also have princesses. Look at that, oh my goodness. All of this stuff is so adorable. My Disney loving heart, can't take it. Brian's into all the Star Wars stuff. I'm not into Star Wars, but he loves it. But they have all, the galaxy. yeah, this pillow is really, really cute. It's like a nice dusty blue color. I really like this little striped pillow with these like tie tassels. It says you are my everything in like an olive green color, but then it has this nice striping. I feel like this is kind of similar to the vibe of our nursery. So if you were looking for any hints, this is kind of a hint, but not really. One thing I love about this store is how much clearance they have. They have so much clearance like all of these items this was 65 and now it's 1649 and i love the neutral colored animals there's like sheep and then i think what is that what is that i think it's meant to be like a sheep and a pig but that's a really really good deal look how adorable that is this is a really sweet changing pad cover everything is so girly this is the modern room so it has this like really cool geometric wallpaper and then all of the furniture is like really really clean lines like look at that this has, I don't think that this is very modern, the gingham, but I'm sure somebody just like stuck that there, but just like super simple crib. This is the Hudson by Baby Leto collection. Here's all the Disney stuff that we were looking at, but it's kind of like set up. This crib sheet is so, so sweet. I definitely think we'll have lots of crib sheets. Like I feel like you can never have too many. Oh yeah, they have the safety reminder right here. So never use soft bedding just to create like a safe sleep environment. So really this stuff is just for decoration, but I do love the shape of this crib. I feel like it still has clean lines, but it's softened by like the angles that it has. This is the Emma Regency by Million Dollar Baby collection. This one's a little bit pricier. This crib is 500 and then they have like the dresser and a nice bookshelf that matches. This is awesome. Keep in mind too, you can always change out the hardware of any of these items. This is really Really, really nice like the divided compartments right here you could put like a basket and then keep like diapers right here and it has the same shape as the crib all of these blankets are so so soft they're chenille and it's embroidered with love and has these little like pom-pom balls they have pink gray and white they also have the Ugg brand these ones are incredibly soft as well these are $34.99 I just love how they have so many different colors oh look at this one the embroidery is all like heart shaped. That one is $60. It has the Sherpa on the other side. So if you live somewhere super cold, that one's really fun, especially with her due date being so close to Valentine's Day. That one's so sweet. I really love this Winnie the Pooh set. I didn't see this over there. It's kind of like a vintage 100 acre woods collection. Like Winnie the Pooh and Piglet and Tigger look like they're like original versions. This is so, so soft. They also have like a changing pad cover. This quilt is really, really beautiful. And I love how it like has all the characters, but I like how it's like still the neutral color and it's like a little bit more vintage. This is really nice. Okay, so one big discovery we made today is that we need to order the rocking ottoman or the gliding ottoman that goes with our glider. We got a power recliner glider. We got the Baby Leto kiwi chair and it looks just like this, honestly, exactly like this. And they have an ottoman that looks like this 
but it glides like this one so when you're like sitting it kind of like moves with you and I can't even explain to you how comfortable this is. Okay, so that was a bunch of the decor. They have such cute options here. I'm glad that we were able to see stuff in person because we actually have not started the nursery makeover yet. We're like in the beginning stages. We've ordered some things, picked out some things. We know what the vibe is gonna be. So it's really fun to actually see things in person and not just like pictures on Pinterest. Now we're gonna talk about like strollers and all of that stuff, look at all that. I do wanna preface with saying that this is our first baby. We are hoping to have many babies so we did definitely splurge on more expensive brands you definitely don't have to do that we just wanted to splurge on things that we know will last us a super long time so that is kind of like the decision making process for us like it's our first we really want to invest in things that we hope will last a super long time have great warranties things that the companies really stand behind so Let's look at like strollers and stuff. I'm so excited. All right, so we're playing with the stroller. We just got our stroller, but we have not unboxed it yet. So Brian's just kind of like playing with it. We got the Upa Vista V2 in the color Declan, which I don't see here, but it's like a really nice oatmeal color. So they have like the rumble seat option. This stroller is really good because you can grow into it. They have like the rumble seat. They also have the bassinet for like when they're an infant. You can also clip the car seat into it. And there's also this piggyback attachment. So like you can have two kids on the stroller and then a third one on the piggyback, like riding on the piggyback. So it can work for up to three kids. Brian said it rolls a little too good. <laughs> We're both just having fun. They have so many of each stroller here. So we're both just pushing the different configurations. It comes in so many different colors. They have like the green, they have navy. Up there they have the Alice, which is the pink, which I did not get the pink because I don't, I can't guarantee you. the rest of our kids will be girls. So I didn't want to be stuck with the pink or married to the pink. <laughs> That's a jogging stroller. These are like bike tires. <laughs> Yeah, that one's probably made for like exercising. Oh my god, or mountain running. Oh. <laughs> like I was saying, they also have the gray, like the light gray and the dark gray. And then they have the different colors of the leather. But we went with the oatmeal color that sadly they don't have right here. Brian just can't get over all the different options of everything that they have. This is like luxury brand. Yeah, look at the cup holder. I don't see our brand here of car seat. We got the Nuna Pippa Light RX car seat. They have so many different car seats and that's just an infant one so we'll need to pick another one when she like grows out of the infant car seat so if you have any recommendations definitely let me know down below now we're looking at some of the carriers it's just so unbelievable like how many options there are of everything like when i was making my registry it was overwhelming to like sift through all the options but you can find like lists on amazon or like lists all over the internet like of people's recommendations and it's easy to look up videos but when you're here you're just kind of like thrown into it and it's fun these carriers there's so many different options. There's like all the baby Bjorn ones. I always say Bjorn and Brian always corrects me. These ones look really nice. They're extremely pricey. We got one of the Ergo Baby Carriers. I'm not exactly sure which one we got, but I think it's this one. It's a newborn carrier. So I want to get one that we can use when she's a little bit older too. Brian found this carrier. The store is fun. <laughs> this is like a sport travel thing. We'll need this for our trips to Arizona. And we do all of our hikes. Yeah. With the baby. Look at that thing. That's intense. <laughs> Sweet. We can't leave here without looking at some of the clothes. Brian's already picked out a little outfit. What do you got? <laughs> Brian's obsessed with St. Patrick's Day. So we had to get this little like two piece outfit, but we're gonna get a couple more cute little things. This little Calvin Klein outfit is so sweet. I love like the lace at the end. I don't love how it says like Calvin Klein across the front, but I like the style of the outfit, like the little ruffles and how neutral it is. I really like solid colors. I'm not really into like big bold patterns it's fine for things like st patrick's day like those little outfits are really adorable but for every other day i just like really simple stuff like this i said that and then i immediately gravitated towards this like i like this like the florals like i just feel like that's so fun this is a hoodie and pants set it's hard because like she's gonna be born obviously in february but 
you know, it gets warm really, really fast. So whenever I like look at sweat outfits like this, I always go towards like the bigger sizes, like something that she could potentially wear next year when it gets cold again. And I just feel like she'd be so adorable running around in this little tracksuit. Okay, this denim jacket though, this is so adorable. I know that it's not practical at all, but I just love the little ruffles. It's just so, so girly, so frilly, so pretty. I love this little dress outfit. I wear tons of dresses, so it is safe to say that she will be in tons of like bubbles and dresses and just things really similar to I would wear myself. And I'm sure we will match lots of days as well. They have tons of like Carter's clothing here, but lots of other brands too. But I love, love, love this like green, ditzy floral print. I love this set. You get like this grayish brown sweater with a onesie and then this really adorable pair of leggings. All of the clothes are like 30% off. Look how adorable with like the eyelet ruffle. <sighs> I need to walk away. They have these velour pants. They are so soft. They have them in every single color and they come with a matching headband. And then up here you can like mix and match with these different like onesie shirts. Look at these. Oh my goodness. And then I really like these um, like velvet overall dresses. I just think dresses are gonna be the way to go for us. But like, look at all this really, really sweet stuff. Everything right here is so beautiful. Like look at this woven sweater with the buttons. Again, I know it's not practical, but we're just like looking at adorable stuff here. This has like a tulle ruffle. They also have these really beautiful sweaters down here. The stuff they have here, it's just endlessly adorable. They have so many cute clothes. All the furniture is really, really fun. It's really just exciting to kind of like see everything. We have a lot of stuff at home and we've started like washing everything and prepping, but I don't know, coming in here definitely makes it way more real. And I feel like once she's here, maybe we'll make more trips here. It's just like the baby version of Target. So once you have a baby, you get to come here more. What'd you think? I love it. It's great. It is the baby version of Target. It's overwhelming. It's it's like and Bed Bath & Beyond. They're owned by the same company. I don't love shopping online, so it's really cool to come to a place like this and like push the stroller around or sit in the rocking chair, so I love it. Yeah, because we haven't gotten to push our stroller around yet, so we're really excited for that to come in the mail so we can put it together and take it for a walk around the block, even though it won't have a baby in it. But yeah, this has been really fun. I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing us shop for baby stuff too. Well, all right, you guys, there you have it. A bye-bye baby shop with me. I really hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. I know it's a little bit different than what I normally do, but so many of you requested seeing us shop for baby items. So I really hope that you guys had fun today. If you enjoyed it and you haven't yet, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below and the notification bell. That store is very overwhelming. There are just so many baby things. And obviously as first time parents, we're still figuring it all out as we go. We're really excited for our daughter to arrive. We're just I don't know. So excited. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you guys so much for shopping with me today and every day. I love you so much and I'll see you next time. Bye guys. Wait, wait. I've been waiting all day. Bye bye, baby. <laughs> <laughs>